breaking news that's coming in. Uh, the UK Home Secretary has approved the extradition of Vijay Malia. Sanjay Suri now joins us uh, with more details. So Sanjay, this was one step that was awaited after the court had ratified uh, the extradition of Vijay Malia. The next key stage was, of course, uh, the decision taken by the Home Secretary. How does this then uh, shape out as far as the extradition process as sought by India is concerned? Well, uh, this uh, certainly gets one hurdle out of the way for India because after the magistrate considered the arguments, uh, she ordered uh, uh, rather, she ordered that uh, the file uh, should be sent to the Home Secretary for his consideration. He has now uh, approved uh, the extradition. Now, this becomes the springboard mm -hmm. for uh, Vijay Malia to launch his appeal in the High Court. So. This now kickstarts the mm -hmm. next and certainly the last process in this long uh, legal on this long legal path, where Malia will now go to the mm -hmm. High Court in appeal against this particular order of the Secretary of State concerning the magistrate's order. All right. So Sanjay, can we say that uh, when when this uh, matter went from the court to the Home Secretary's office, somewhere? Uh, call had to be taken at a political level and now at a political level at least India and UK see eye to eye on the matter of course there is a there is a legal recourse still available right now well, uh, it is not an practically political decision it is almost a rubber stamping that is uh, is, is routine uh, for the secretary of state the only factor uh, for um, was that there are some grounds on which the secretary of state still have booked extradition grounds that were considered and are not for the court, the magistrate's court to consider. He considered those and uh, decided to disregard the uh, claims of Malia and to go ahead and order the extradition. Right. And uh, any word in uh, from Vijay Malia's lawyers at this stage, how soon they may go in uh, for appeal? Any reactions coming in? And no, don't have a date. They have confirmed that they have given notice uh, that they will go in a peace. But this is now expected uh, very soon, uh, within, certainly uh, within the next two weeks. All right. Uh, since they could be uh, appealing very soon, and Ashmit, you were telling us that he has a time for about 14 days. Correct. So that is a window that is currently available to him that he will probably be exercising that option. Uh, this order, as and when it comes out, uh, will be in the form of a written order. And subsequently, that once that written order is out, it will naturally, uh, that's just one legal remedy that is available to Vijay Malia. Uh, experience tells us that that is one option that he's likely to exercise.